Hey guys, Nick Drosos. Got a question from Olivia. Nick, how do I escape from a tie wrap? But before we start, go visit my website, nickdrosos.com. Just launched the Tactical Edge program, knife defense program, over 48 step-by-step -step lessons, and it's at 50% off. So go check it out, as well as our Bob Fit program. Uh, now, we just finished pressure testing a few, uh, a few ways to escape. And I purposely asked Costa to put this part over here on the side. And what happened was, in order for the escape to work, the first thing you need to do, guys, we're using smaller ones because we didn't have any bigger ones, but the concept is the same. What happens is you have to use, you have to bring this little, the, the, the middle piece that connects into the middle right over here because this is where you're gonna have to put all your force. Now what happened was, as I started pulling it, to try to bring it in the middle, I actually started tightening it even more. So I just figured this out as I was doing it. So the first thing you wanna do is find a way that if you're gonna use your mouth, do not start pulling from this part because all you're gonna do is tighten it. Pull it from the edge here, this way, and find a way to start playing with it until you could get it in the middle. So I'm just gonna kind of pull it. Kind of. Ugh. It's a lot harder than I thought. Ah, oh, there we go, okay. Getting it a little bit closer. Wow, it's a lot harder than I thought. I just try to loosen it up a little bit. You guys can see right now, my hands are starting to be all red and I'm starting to lose a little bit of circulation. So let's just give it a shot. I mean, the other thing I'm thinking is I might as well use a little bit of saliva here. Uh, what? Well, just that. I know it's a little bit disgusting, guys, but I'm I'm trying to grease it to make it slippery, loosen it up, so I can bring it into the middle. Yeah. getting there. So what I'm trying to do is I'm trying to stick my hands closer together. Getting there. Sorry guys, I'm trying this for the first time and I just kind of, I'm playing with, I mean just, I know it's a little bit disgusting, but putting saliva on it, you guys can see my blood flow starting to, just play with it. Okay, it's as close as I can get it to the middle. Let me just try again. Ugh. Fuck, it hurts. Okay, now, you guys can see it's all red. It's fucking actually starting to burn. First thing is, if I pull this way, I don't have as much leverage. I look at it like doing a back, a back row. So I'm gonna bend down here, this way, and I'm gonna push, explode, bringing the elbows in, my shoulder blades, everything. So one, two, three. Ah! You guys could see, holy smokes, it was actually, and it took me quite a bit. I mean, guys, I was being creative. We pressure tested earlier, and that's what happened when I was pulling from that piece, it was tightening, and I just used the saliva as just, you know, at the moment, just thinking, well, how can I make it, 
How could I lubricate it in a way that I could twist it, bring it in the middle, come down and then pop it out. Ow, you can see this hurts. On the next lesson, we're gonna see if they're tied behind your hands, uh, what you can do to escape, as well as, well, the reality is, how do I fight if he has me tied and he's, he's bringing me to a car, a secondary location, or he's in a position where he's trying to strike me. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Go visit my website, nickjoseph.com, stay safe.